yesterday's heavy rain super slow. it was falling like anything and i understood i have created buns in that template yeah beautifully to block the water from gushing with full speed nature is powerful but we can guide the powerful man to our thinking too provided we work with it so the workers did the work and morning i rushed up to have a look at all those places very few places the buns were broken all of this, the water got <laughs> there and there was almost zero flooding anywhere except in front of the dining hall so there was the last day that in the temple area the clearing and decorating around the trees went on very well tired mas oyama this is a fifth sixth coat said no matter how strong the rival the just will always win that you must keep it in mind how much you were strong and kyokushin was one style which is proved the small can beat the big and and what technique so say masoyama did which nobody else thought about it they all said techniques and they were all practicing and teaching in the dark and made a fool of the people thinking these people know so many techniques and they can win there is no techniques you have to have the spirit no matter how strong the rival the moment you think that rival is tall and strong than you you lost the battle you have to first have trust on how much effort you have put on your practice that is the connecting no no matter how strong the rival you don't care as long as you have trust on your body mental physical spiritual then the tallest man the most powerful man so sir masuma trained the short japanese to hit on the lower leg lower leg when the foundation is broken not lower leg one they might be able to take but they sit take the hit on the same leg on the lower leg the foundation shakes and any tall man kept falling down it is not about the height and the moment you measured the height and the weight you are gone you have to measure your height and your weight your possibility so so masoyama Mas said no matter how strong the rival the just will always win the just means is not the law the just means your confidence on what you have practiced and you have shared it most of the karate masters what they did they kept on practicing and they never put it up into into the society what so say masima said the just will always win means if you are strong and you can roar like a thousand men warrior you must go to the neighborhood to find out how you can help the neighborhood to save rain water and rain water harvesting how you can help the neighborhood to have solar and wind energy how you can feed at a ten or hundred or thousand students and help them in their medicine and their studies so this becomes practical what happened is no matter how strong the rival the moment you see the rival you started shivering because all what you practice is become one way traffic 
Hence, the Indian system, the just will always win. What is the just? The just is the child has been taught, even if the child is very strong. And even the child is now, it is not about physical power, it is about the uh, software engineers and other MBA students who make more money. They are physically very weak. What they are telling is as long as you are connected to your family, you sharing with your family, you eating in the same plate, you have the family and then you connect to the joint family and the family tree. This makes you to understand about the solar and wind energy and to share to your cousins, to your brothers, to your sisters and to the neighborhood. And when you and the cousins and the brothers and sisters join together, help the neighborhood, that was the power. The just will always win. That just will win. Not that you practice, you might hit one man, but what about the society outside? You go home, you practice heavily and you make your wife and your uh, other people to feed you a lot and you stay in a very pathetic situation, most of the karate masters. No, it is a one-way traffic. You are poisoning the society. Come out of that poisoning. So I so, said, no matter how strong the rival, the rival is together is your power. If you can take everybody together, there is richness. Henry Ford also said, richness is thy name. Richness follows you. You need to have richness in your heart, in your mind. And at the same time, vitamin M yesterday, um, Topaz IAS Academy Chairman, Mr. Somashekar was here. He said, vitamin M. I said, what is vitamin M and vitamin M? He says, money. Yes. In the materialistic world, you have to have that money. Yes, no doubt about it. You move with the crowd. I did the crowd trample you. No more with the crowd, but be an individual crowd. So the Master said, no matter how strong the rival, you don't bother about the rival. The just will always win if you, what Ramana Maharshi has taught you. Ask who am I? And Jesus Christ said, knock at the door, shall be opened. And Bob Marley said, Get up, stand up, stand up for your rights. And Swami Vivekananda said, Awake, arise, stop not till the goal is reached. All that is a connecting link that you carry your family together, equally share it. The day you don't share and you become greedy and you buy a, a pigeon hole apartment for 5 crore, 24, 25 crore, keep your relatives far away, you live in fear. Then you cannot beat your rival. It is easy to beat your rival if you can practice this one thing, no matter how strong the rival, then just will always win. Keep your practice 70s. Keep your Sanskriti. Don't forget the Sanskrit. When you come back home, leave your mind and the slippers outside and just be with your wife and the children. Eat on the same plate, massage together, take baths together. And any rival in the world, they are not coming at you. 